Crib Mac behind bars, man. It's CEO. It's CEO TV on hood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I already know why you're here, and it's not because of me. You seen that title, so you had to tap in. So go and smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and make sure you tap that bell. Yeah, so I don't know if y'all saw my video. Uh, some of y'all did, some of y'all didn't. So yeah, he got caught with a, a firearm a few months ago, went to jail, and bailed out. He was on bail. Y'all remember when I posted a video about him being in jail? He called me and told me to take that video down. But it was already, I wasn't the only person to post the video. That's when I was able to talk to him and see, like, bro, what happened? How you in jail? Who, 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 who are you with? Blah, 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 blah. He's like, don't be posting that. Don't be saying that. You know, you trying to get me back in jail. And tell Rick Rock to take that video down. Y'all going to get me in jail, my P.O. I'm like, bro, if you're going to go to jail because of probation violation, that's going to happen regardless, bro. We got his in and off the line. But out of respect for you, I'm going to take it down. Whatever, right? Anyway, so he he uh, he bailed out on the spot, you know what I'm saying, had court dates, and he we, I had a fight for him and some other stuff going on for him. And he was telling me, yeah, I got to go turn myself in for the uh, violation. I'm going to get right back out of my violation, but I'm going to be fighting my case from the streets. I'm the, my, got, good, got a good, good lawyer. He's going to let him fight it from the streets for about a year, then he better do like a year at some point. But he's like, I'm already be rich by then. Ooh, 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 right? But I never knew what kind of gun or what happened, the whole story, because he was kind of secretive on it, like, you know, what happened, because, you know, I'm, I'm going to tell him about himself. When I'm with him, he don't do all that, bro. We ain't doing none of that. We ain't getting no trouble. I got my legit fire on, and we going where I say go, where it's safe, and you ain't going to be in no trouble. You ain't going to jail on my watch. That's out. You ain't about to have my homies, your homies clowning me, talking about how you in jail. No, 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 we don't even, we, we don't get out of there. I don't even go to jail like that, catch cases. But long story short, I didn't really know what was going on. He went to court yesterday with the homies. They was in court with him. It's three feds in the courtroom. The state drop it. And that's usually how they do it. I talked to people who went to the feds and been picked up by feds before at the state case. And they said that they make the state drop the case and the feds pick it up. And they picked it up and they booked him right there on the spot. You know what I'm saying? So why won't they do that? The homie like, nah, bro. It was a switch. I said, ooh, that's why they came and got it. Oh. See, he knew and his inner circle knew what kind of gun it was and what was going on. They just don't be telling me all this stuff, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, oh, we got a switch on? I said, well, that's ugly. And by the feds come get you like that from court, it's pretty serious, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, hey, man, um, friends go out to him, free, free, uh, free baby Crip Mac off the 55th Street, you know what I'm saying? You are now locked in to CEO TV. It's for the people, you heard me.